All right, folks. I for let's talk about something I just thought of. That's pretty interesting. Okay. Phew. So there's a few things to talk about besides me waiting for someone to drive. So here's just a few thoughts now. I guess thought number one that's pretty funny is for the past two, in quotations, two seasons, um, Power Rangers has been forgetting a Zord. You know, they debuted a Zord, but yet we don't see the Zord in stores. Well, at least we're the Beast X King Zord. Well, at least the good news is that that one, we actually might know that exists. Uh, the Sub Surfer Zord, we have no idea whatsoever. Yeah, they didn't even think of how having molds or anything of it, so. <laughs> oh, dang, man. Dang. But yeah, it's kind of funny that we have two seasons in a row that actually gets the idea of giving us a big sword. Well, actually, a Zord. We can just say Zord. A Sub Surfer Zord, even though. It would be messed up and basically sell us another Megazord, but it's color swap purple. Yeah, you can understand that. <laughs> They're like, oh, no. Because it was hard beforehand, even though it's kind of funny to be like, having pink in the Zord is not okay. But having purple is. Until people said, no, that's not good. No, that's gross. No, good, girl. What, what the? <laughs> yeah, so now, even though they just said with a dino charge hey purple's okay yeah it's like yeah but you just basically said that it's like yeah you, dino charge you said hey it's okay to trade with purple and now you're like no no we're not gonna release the purple at all oh no oh no even though it's like yeah but you release the plesio charge megazord that doesn't make sense <laughs> All right, so the main topic today is the TV show, of course. The idea I just came up with, which is pretty interesting. The idea for the, the thing is that, what if we can actually have the two secret characters, uh, the two secret rangers, that, or special rangers that should be here, what if those two rangers actually was Blazing Rocks and what if they actually sent them out on secret, secret missions, you know? It's like, Evox can't just only have one plan. It would be cool that he had multiple plans, especially the idea of he went international as the mayor. And where the hell's the mayor? But he went international with the mayor. It's kind of hard that he went internationally around the world and he didn't decide while the Rangers are busy he decides to go international and while he's there and just say, oh, here's a Giga Drone. Even though I think that was actually promoting the international idea of having Morphex Towers internationally. So I guess technically that's already defunct to being like, yeah, but that won't work considering he's making the idea that it should happen. It's not already there. So it's like, oh. But I think it would be kind of cool that we did have some kind of interesting secret mission thing that's going on. That would have been cool. And then, of course, I just want to have the figures. I seriously just want to have the figures. Uh, Blaze gets to be the Black Ranger now, and Roxy gets to be the Green Ranger. Which makes sense because, oh, the frog is kind of like the um, rabbit. And. I think was Leopard. So yeah, I think that actually would work out nicely and that would actually help a little bit better with the idea of Blaze coming back, especially at the end of the whole entire series. Blaze truly coming back and doing stuff where it's like, it would be cool to have hints that he is working for Grid Battle Force still, kind of, and Roxy is kind of too, but since it's super secret, it's kind of hush-hush. Because right now we have Blaze who just works at the gym, I guess. It's like, yeah, so what does he do for work? And then Roxy, same deal, where it's like, what does she do for work? Besides, maybe she actually works with her aunt to save the sea life, I guess. I'm not sure if that actually pays, but I guess since it's not profit, it could actually do pay. 
can actually paint. I'm not sure, but I will say that if they do, it does work out. If they do actually work and that's how they work, then okay, I guess that's how it works. But you kind of would figure that, hey, during the mission, they actually got hurt and they got put in comas. So you would figure that that's already a free pass to be like, yeah, you guys get to work in big Battle for Steel. It's like, because, you know, you guys got stricken and since your jobs got taken away from you, that doesn't mean that you don't get to work still, that we're still not going to pay you. So it's like, yeah, it's, I don't know. But I would say that it would have been cool to just have two more Rangers. I really just want the figures. So, yeah. Um, that's all I have to say on that. Is would have been cool to have a little bit more than just this weird episode that came. Oh, time to go beat Spider-Man. <laughs> just kidding. Yeah, but it's kind of like, hmm, could you not actually have a nice little more setup? They just blaze all of a sudden, just get access like that. It's like, he shouldn't really get access like that, should he? I don't think he should. <laughs> it's like, yeah, unless there's like some secret clearance thing and then they reveal it and it's like, oh, so that's why he's in here. Instead of this where it's like, I get he used to be, but you guys didn't implement anything that he gets clearance and crap besides you can easily say, oh, Devin cleared him. And it's like, oh, I don't get it. I don't understand him. How in the world is he doing all this and getting... It's like, it makes sense that the reason why he reverted back is because of the special missions, even though I know it's Robo Blaze, but it will be kind of cool to be like, you do have hints that he's reverting back to his old self because, well, he's back in the same mindset that he was because they did him, they actually sent him on secret missions along with Roxy. That alone would be a good story of itself. But I guess, oh no, they're not going to do this. And I'll still say the episode was pretty good. They got me off guard, but I kind of did see a little bit of it coming. But I still have to say, it's kind of weird that he just reverted back all of a sudden and you gave him clearance again, even though it doesn't make sense. You gave him clearance. Not to mention, you guys actually do have metal detectors, right? How come you guys didn't detect his, him being metal? What the frick was that? 